Have you ever noticed when a narcissist starts to hoover you and love bomb you, they'll have conversations with themselves? It is weird. Like they will be pouring their soul out to you in an email and a text saying, I miss you, we need to be back together. But then they'll start to throw in random facts about what they're doing in their life. Like, I finally redid the living room or look, I got a haircut, here's a picture. Why do they do that? First of all, narcissists are not grounded in reality. A lot of times when you break up with them, they don't even accept it. Like you will definitely say, we are done, don't ever speak to me again. And they act like you never even said anything. For a narcissist, it is in their best interest to smooth things over with you as quickly as possible. And they feel like if they start giving you nuggets about their life, that will hook you back in. You have to remember that in a narcissist's mind, the world revolves around them. So updating you about what's going on in their life, in their mind is like, of course they would want to know. They should want to know every single thing about me, even if we're broken up. I guarantee in that same email, there is going to be a huge guilt trip in order to manipulate you. That could look like, I'm so sad without you. How can I live without you? Everybody abandons me. They're going to make themselves into the victim. But what you will not see in that email or text is any accountability for all the hurt that they caused you during the course of the relationship. If they are saying, I miss you, that's not the same as, I'm sorry, I realize that I messed up. They will guilt you and future fake you at the same time by saying, if you just would have stuck it out, we could have been happy together. They will tell you all the nice things they were planning to do for you before you broke up. Well, I wanted to take you on that vacation you mentioned a hundred times, but I didn't do anything about when we were together. Well, I was going to propose to you, but then we broke up. This is all future faking. They are baiting you to reel you back into the web. If they truly wanted to do any of that stuff, they would have done it during the course of the relationship. At this point now, they are still selling you that same package of lies that they sold you in the beginning to get you hooked. Can you get to a point where you say, I no longer want anything from this person. Whatever they offer me in an email, in a text, I feel that I don't even need to respond to that because that is a past chapter and I am ready to move on.